Hi everyone, I'm Amber. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be reviewing the Moana 2 second teaser trailer. I know I'm a little bit behind on this, but we're going to watch it. We're going to review it. We're going to do all the things. I'm very excited. As I mentioned before, um, it is one of my favorite movies and I'm really excited to see what the second one has in store. So, without further ado, if my phone lets me, or if it doesn't, let's get started. All right. Oh, she's running. Oh, through the forest. Oh, something's chasing her. It's Pua. Oh, to see the Pua. <laughs> he didn't come last time. It's a little sister. Oh. Okay. She's so cute. All oh, the water. Oh, there's the lightning. It's a little bit more dramatic this time. Oh, 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 oh. Thanksgiving. Why would going to that island stop the curse? Okay, there's a curse because of Maui. Who are these people? I still don't know who these people are. Who are you? Raven later. I miss this tattoo. It was fun. Aww. She'll come back. Aww. What? Oh, Grandma! And there goes Hey Hey. Ooh, they're back. I love these little guys. Do they? Oh, 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 hey, hey. Oh. Oh, oh, she's passed out. What is happening? It looks very beautiful. I'm so excited. So excited. Okay. So, basically... We see a lot of things that we did in the first one, but we get a little bit more explanation. Maui, he stole the stone of Tefiti, um, obviously causing issues. And before that, they were going to unite um, the people in surrounding villages, islands, etc. Um, but they stopped that for whatever reason. I don't really know the full explanation of it. I hope it explains a little bit more. Um, when Maui stole the stone. Um, and then, now apparently they are cursed because <laughs> they are cursed because of what he did. But why are they cursed? Um, I guess it's like spiritual um, ancestors and people like um, beings rather that are cursing the people whom Maui gifted many things to. Um, so maui did very bad again um and he has to right his wrong of course um and he seems willing to this time we have a baby sister we have a moana baby sister i'm so excited i'm so excited she looks so cute um and i think this is going to add a new like dynamic on like her you know going and uh, going on this journey and being gone for so long you know she has like this extra like pressure of like getting back home because she has her baby sister um there's a scene with the grandma really excited like so i think this movie's gonna be very like much talking about like the spiritual aspects um there's this whole like ritual thing that was going on um and before she was like let go on her journey um i don't know what that was about but i'm excited and then that's when ba boom um so i'm really excited pua wants wanted to come okay good job pua um 
how is he gonna jump over the ledge uh, the, the, the the gap uh in between the rocks i don't know um but poor little piggy uh hey hey i think it's just kind of there like he was in the first movie i think Pooh is gonna have much more like character development and stuff um but yeah um overall i am very very excited um i still don't know who the people she's you know journeying with um they could be like people from nearby like islands i don't know why they're going to that island specifically because they said they set foot on that island it would break the curse why i don't know um there's some sort of mystical raven being thing um that maui says he likes lava monster better but i don't know how intimidating this thing is so we'll see um they look like they're in a cave uh there's a lot more maui magic power thing so i'm really excited about that like i hope there's not a lot of repetition from the first movie because they're encountering the like what are they called something uh, i don't even want to try um the little coconut dudes um and i know i could say it if i saw the word um because i have before but anyway um i know they've encountered them before so um obviously like there's reason for that maybe they're gonna like discover more about that like they seem to have gotten captured um from what i see in the trailer and i don't know what they're going to do with them if we're gonna end up in their little lair um because at first they wanted the stone so now what do they want to steal probably maui's staff thing um i i don't know um did they try to steal that on the first one i think it was just a stone um so yeah um and i'm eager to see what these new characters um like bring like why are they there like is it just for comedic effect are they gonna have any kind of influence um like what is their motivation how do they end up here kind of thing um and maui like you know traveling with some other humans like you know he's a demigod so it's like I kind of want to see that um because he's just used to moana at that point like he does his own thing he's not used to the people um so i'm intrigued to see that um even though he gave things to the people he's not really a people person um i i uh, don't know if like in the process of getting to this island she's already like meeting people from different islands that might be who they are and they might like join in they might be people from her tribe i really do not know um and i <laughs> am intrigued to see um how <laughs> pua and hey hey interact on the trip um because hey hey is very much his own independent little chicken uh, rooster um and you know pua is a little bit more feisty um so i think um it's gonna be interesting seeing the two together and i think they're gonna have their own little like buddy dynamic kind of going on which is gonna be i think very cute and very sweet it kind of reminds me almost of like the the dog and the cricket from like mulan kind of thing um and i'm curious to see like moana's parents like how like they and their relationship has changed and like what what it what is it like now with the little girl and like you know her being a full-on like adult i assume she's an adult um then going off and doing all these different things um so yeah um and then if she's like a wave rider isn't there like other people that go with her but it's just her on her own so i think it's just her quest personally um um overall just really excited for the movie um there's not more much i can say um there is just a lot of repeats from the first one but there were some you know little things that they added um that i appreciated because i wanted some more explanation but i was kind of waiting until the movie came out for that but now things are answered so 
yay. And now I'm excited just kind of to see the movie and see what else they're going to do and, you know, kind of like tie up loose ends. But I'm hoping that, because when they tend to answer some questions or give a lot in a trailer, um, it tends to be that's all in the movie and there's nothing more. There's no more explanation and everything. And I'm left with more questions than answers. Um, so yeah, I, I hope that's not the case. Um, I'm hoping there's obviously a lot more. I mean, it feels like there is. Um, and so, yeah. So thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you all soon. Bye.